Learn how to easily create a spray paint stencil effect in Photoshop with a multi-color overspray. Let's begin by typing some text or importing an image. This works best by using a PNG file with a transparent background. But in my case, I'm just using some text, so let's align that to center and then change the blending mode to dissolve. This creates a rough outline around your artwork that replicates the look of paint bleeding. Now go to Filter, Blur Gallery, and select Field Blur, then choose Convert to Smart Object. With this filter, you can place pins around your artwork and increase or decrease the amount of blur to replicate paint overspray. Once you're happy with how it looks, just hit OK. Now let's duplicate the text layer and right click on the top text layer to convert to smart object. Double click on the bottom text layer and change the color to a different color of overspray. And I'll be using red. Then close the file and save changes. Now click on the field blur filter on your bottom text layer and change the pin location and blur amount to add your multicolor overspray effect. Once you're happy, just hit OK. And now for a final touch, let's add a concrete texture and change the blending mode. Scroll through the blending modes to see what looks best for you, but I personally like the way hard light looks. Then just decrease the opacity. Next, duplicate the concrete texture and drag it to the bottom layer. Remove the blending mode and increase the opacity. Now you have a realistic spray paint stencil effect in Photoshop. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to not miss any more helpful tips like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.